Hello, hello today I'm going to show you how to um, enter into the restore mode of your Apple iPad Pro. In this case, it's the version of 2024. 20, and this device, we uh, have maybe this device, you have some trouble with it. That means you cannot enter into the system or you have forgotten your PIN code and so um, as well. Then the, the easiest way is you use iTunes on a computer still running, a cable connection by using an Apple certified cable. That means we have to make a cable connection with the iPad Pro and the computer, which um, there is um, iTunes running already. And then we have here the iPad, okay? The iPad over there comes with the power button over there with the volume up and the volume down button. Okay, you can see volume up, volume down, and here's the power button. And now we perform a hard reset process or a soft reset to, to reach the reboot uh, process. But in this case, we go and let um, push the power button and then it will be go into the restore mode. Okay, let's perform this volume up, volume down, power button, key pushing. Now I push only the power button and keep hold this until we see on the screen that we enter into the restore mode. Okay, let this will cost you, I think, 10 seconds or something else. A little bit. Wait, wait, wait. Um, wait, 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 wait. Here we are. Okay, this is the sign to connect now the device. Here we are. Huh? There it is. And now we can connect or we already connect um, our device with the computer system. Okay, now let's have a look at the computer system and there you can see and read what's going on there. There is a problem with the iPad that requires to be updated or restored. Okay, because now we are in restore mode. The problem may be fixed by updating our iPad, which prefers our settings and content. That's a good deal. This you should perform first. Um, however, if updating doesn't work, it may be necessary to restore our iPad, which erase all settings and content on it. If we backed up our iPad in the, the, in the past, on the computer or iCloud, for example, we will prompt it to restore the backup onto the iPad. We will need our iCloud password or on, um, the Find My has been enabled. So you can see if you are trying this with an, an stolen iPad, for example, which you does not have the, uh, the Apple ID, it, uh, hmm. this is the iCloud lock, which comes after this. But if you are owner of your iPad you, and you only just forgotten your passcode to enter into the, to, to the system, you can make the system running after restore, uh, restore. So first step is we are updating our system. If that does not um, fix our problem, we can to go to restore. Okay, then another um, uh, information comes. Are you sure you want to restore your iPad Pro to its factory settings? All our medias and other data will be erased off it, and the newest version of the iPad software will be installed. This is a good thing because after this, it is restored and brand new for you, software based. And then you can make a clear um, setup and you are back in business. Okay, so restore and update. Now we have to um, update agreement here and it starts. Good job. You see now the um, device is downloading, is downloading and um, make the process in the background. So I stop this now for here because I does not have to do this now. Um, after 20 minutes, 30 minutes, um, your iPad should be ready for a re, uh, reset up or, um, and you can go through the setup process easily. If you like to abort this process, as I shown you now, you see your device does not have any function anymore and you cannot mm, come back into the system. It's not a big deal because we now make a, um, a soft reset. That means we are um, going to reboot the system by using volume up, volume down, power button and keep it pushing until you see the Apple branding. Okay, so we can abort this setup 
process or this restore mode set up again. The other thing is after 20 minutes, it will automatically uh, reboot the system. So here we are. And, um, but the main, the main thing is of course, you have to wait until iTunes download the software, download the operation system and uh, reinstall this on your device. And after this, you can make a clear setup again and you can give you a new um, face ID um, passcode to enter to the system, for example. And of course, a lot uh, of problems are solved with this um, process here. If it does not work anymore, you can go deeper into it by using the DFU mode. Um, and I hope um, this will fix your problems with your iPad Pro. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe me and give me a positive feedback. And I hope to see you again on my channel. Soon, soon.